Hello everyone, my name is Barbara and I'm a Polish girl who lives in Ireland and likes in it and today we're going to do unboxing. Right, this is a hat that, oh, this is a hat I finished so you can check my latest video. But what are we having today? We're having unboxing with the knit crate. They are sending me boxes my way to open up and share it with you guys. Um, I'm getting them almost at the end of the month so it's quite cool because i can have a sneak peek for everyone else what they're getting obviously i still have a surprise i ish know what's going on in each of them but uh, the um, surprise is that i'm not at all aware what kind of colorway i'm going to get because most of the time in each subscription there are a few colors and uh one of those may end up in your box <laughs> Right, so it is monthly subscription and if you have never subscribed to the any box, any yarn, anything like that, you can try with Knitcrate. Uh, they're giving us 20% uh, off, you can use KL20, uh, it, it gives you 20% off for your first box for any subscription. Down below you can find a link, it's affiliate link, so the Knitcrate are sending my way some uh, extras if you use that link. As a thank you of sending you their way. Okay, so uh, one more thing. I love two more things about Knitcrate. Once you subscribe, you can freeze your account, okay, for the previous month. Basically, you try to do it before the first of every month because um, they take money from your account to send you beautiful boxes. And there was a tricky business because normally the sneak speaks, a few colorways here, here and there for the actual month were shown after the first. But lately, if you follow Knit, uh, if you follow Knit Create Instagram, they do lives and they did lately live on the around 20th to give you a sneak peek of the colorways they're going to have in each box to give you an idea do you want to go ahead or do you want to uh, freeze which I think it's it's amazing obviously you know I think it's amazing and uh, they give something like that a possibility for you to think about it or go ahead with it anything else anything else anything else I think that's all what I'm going to, uh, I think that's all I'm going to put all links down below I'm uh, hoping to put timestamps so you have I'm getting three boxes so I'm going to open them now and hopefully if you want to skip something you can go directly there I'm going to put links down below. I'm going to put a quite important links down below, so check them out. Also, one of those things is that I'm knitting with a knit crate yarn, and what I did on this channel, I created a playlist so you can check it out what kind of project I knitted. Each box comes with a pattern for sure, and sometimes I knit them, but most of the cases I'm just uh, treating the yarn like a play doh and just play with it <laughs> and design my own thing. So, um, and that's that. Okay, let's start. Let's start with the one that I'm actually holding because the other two came in envelopes. Okay, for me, it's nothing bad. It means that the width inside of the package is more than usually is, and that's why they had to change that, uh, which means there's a more for me actually, not for the bin. <laughs> Okay, let's start with this one. I don't have a clue what it is, but now on the screen, you know. Woo! Ta-da! So, which one it is? Oh, something new I see in my hand. I have one yarn and I have something new. Right. It's like a book. It's like a magazine. <laughs> Okie dokie. So October is inspirations, but look on the back what the next month is going to bring. Enchanted. Uh -huh. Okay, I've heard about it. That in it crate are just brainstorming there. I don't know with that expression, and they come up with the new ideas and they figure out why not and give you. Do you know what? Give me a second. <laughs> Now I probably know that they put every magazine like that to probably to each of those boxes and it's quite heavy. So that means that, um, mm -hmm. do I have all the patterns? All the patterns. Okay, so in this book, even though I got, I opened just one box, I'm getting all the patterns, all the patterns. 
So I opened the first one, you're going to see what kind of yarn I got, but because I opened it and I checked that there was something new going on, I'm going to flip through all the patterns that are in here, which are in the boxes, but it's in each box because you get the magazine. <laughs> so, because we have all the patterns. So it is a sock, right? It is a sock. So let's go with all the socks patterns and I'll show you all the socks patterns. So we have patterns over here, but we also have information about indie dyers because as I said, they just put everything into one. And uh, some of the boxes you will have a peek what, uh, what they have, what colorways they have. Aren't they great? So it's like, I know time's ticking. Come on, how many patterns do we have here? It's like a magazine. Okay, we have Moss Boss which is a cowl. Okay, I'll show you everything. See this? Huerta. That's, I think it's another shawl. Ah, oh, do you see it? I'm counting on the screen because then we have information about designers. Hello, ladies. Well, we have ladies over here. Uh, about dyers. First frost. We have another shawl. I'm looking for, oh, diamond lace. Guys, thank what I'm going to knit. Now, although I'm not sure about the the thickness, but you know it's fingering. If so, I will hold it double. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. The care and how to keep uh, off non-superwash yarns. I will read. I will read that later. Yes, I'm here. Here. So is that two colorways? Kind of lighter and darker. And I got this one. So the pattern for this box is twisted. Oh, now on the screen you can read the pattern and look at this a sock. I like the texture. Can I use it on a hat? <laughs> now you see I have a problem. I know. But if we have all the patterns about designer, about the dyer, and then we have also artisan sock. So you can pick and choose. That's so cute, isn't it? Right, so I showed you all the patterns. Now, the only difficulty for me is to figure out which box I'm opening. So, um, now my. So what I can say, I can see Vidalana, okay, which is one skein, and I know that if it says by Knitcray, that means that's an in-house brand. <laughs> in-house brand, yeah, in-house brand. And what that tells me so, that I open Sock Crate membership now. Am I right? I don't know, I'm, I'm hoping writing it down on the screen. So this is one color, and I presume there are more I haven't actually checked. I'm talking about October now, we're in October. So on the screen over here, if I can get a print screen, so check it out. The color I got is this beautiful purple. <laughs> haven't, haven't I just put on the side a purple thing? And you told me that you love purple. I think most people, I would say, like purple, right? Guys would like purple, ladies would like purple. It's a color that I think everyone, you know, um, may not be a fan, but they will say it's okay. <laughs> okay, so this is it. This is such a beauty thing. Um, we have the Delana Delight Sock, colorway smooge. We have 80% Sprush Merino, 20% uh, Nylon. And I love this one. I knitted a hat with it and ooh. So uh, 402 yards, 306, 366 meters. On the screen, please read if you're interested in case my pre pronunciation is not the way it should be. <laughs> Vidalana, smudge, smudge, isn't it? Smudge. <laughs> Beautiful color. Oh, <laughs> love it. So here it is. Here's my colorway. Look at this. So beautiful. It's going to be very nice tonal. Instead of having dark bits, it will have light bits. Do you see it? It's like snow. <laughs> Love it so much. Okay, let's move to the next one. And this one is... I don't have a clue. I'm the screen now. <laughs> Ooh. 
So we have the same magazine. I see a goodie and I see two skeins. I believe it's Artisan Knit Crate box. Artisan means that there is an indie dyer who collaborate with Knit Crate for this month and they do a special colorways. Okay, what color I got? Woohoo! I got a gray. I love gray. It's not really gray. It's kind of it has some tone. I'm not sure will you be able to see it or maybe in this light. Okay, so what is it? Oh, it's yarn fairy. Yarn fairy and the... So what it is, is yarn fairy and the pixies. Um, elf merino. 100% extra fine NSW merino. Non superwash, I believe. Merino. 288 yards per 100 grams. Is it the hat that they knitted with it? Brushed steel? Is that the colorway? The next thing is hand wash called lay flat to dry. Raverly Yarn Fair Mystery Cows. A newsletter. So here it is. Here what I got. It looks amazing. I'm not sure why I see a bit of a pinkish. Maybe something is just bouncing off and I'm getting that. But it's a really nice gray. And I think I think is this pattern is a hat or this a beautiful shawl. It's a shawl, isn't it? It looks like a shawl. Cowl. This is a cowl. This is a cowl. Or this beautiful cowl. Oh, nice, nice, nice. But obviously, again, you have the whole booklet. But with Artisan, not only there's a collaboration, there's some goodie coming in with this one. And what do we have now? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, can you see this? Chagoo needles. Okay, we have 4.5 millimeters, which is US size 7, and it is 60 inches, which is 150 centimeters. I don't have needles that long. Do you? Check it out. Do you have 60 inches? My ones are like literally finished on 40 inches. We're talking about cord. And they're quite nice. I like Chagoos, they're quite similar to Haya Haya's. The cable though is a little bit stiffer. I'll show you. Um, oh. It's very hard store thing. I'll show you for instance to compare to, I know it's different length, but. So check it out now on the screen. You can see uh, the cords. And as you can see, for instance, it's very hardware. You could actually see a metal, metal cable going through. It reminds me of the brakes in bike. This, no, this is just um, acrylic strand or something like this. So it's very flexible. Um, Does it say on them? The, no. So the difference also is that Haya Haya's would have uh, a written down information, what kind of tips there are. I hope in the fixed ones they also include. In Chagos you don't have information. I just wanted to double check that. But look at the cord. Yeah, I like they're They're pointy, but they're not sharp. Check the screen. So this chunky little thingy is Haya Haya and it's so pointy. You see this? And this is 4.5 and this is Jagu's, so you can compare. Is there sharp and this is pointy, but not, not so sharp. Okay, so definitely even with this cable you can knit a hat, you can knit even the little thing, although the, the cord is quite thick. Um, but yeah, 4.5 millimeters, you're not going to use anything thin. Uh, so yeah, it just basically work like this, using magic loop. Therefore, I believe for all those two patterns, the hat and the cowl, you need to use 4.5 millimeters. And it is a little bit tricky because it is a little bit tricky with the needles because if you cast on exactly the same number of stitches and you don't have the same tension as the designer, you can end up with the hat that is smaller or bigger. But if you calculate, let's say, pattern of perspective of repetition of the pattern, uh, you can uh, use the same needles but try to play with the pattern template itself. Um, so it's quite fun. I'll... I think we all know what I'm going to knit, right? Will I use these for a hat? <laughs> A 
Okay, let's start with the this one. So I presume this one is a Knit Crate membership. Oh, so much fun. Okay, so let's start with this one. Ta -da! Right. So obviously we have amazing magazine. Amazing. I think for because it's heavier than the Knit Crate thought is going to be, it's going to be split to two magazines next time. So I can't wait for that. I have kind of, something rings my bell, how are they going to do it? But I don't want to say it just in case I jinx it. Knit Crate. Knit Crate comes with two patterns, right? Crocheted and knitted and two skeins of yarn. Oh, it's gorgeous. Look what I got. Oh my, oh my, so pretty. If only my sister would watch it, she would just probably love this color. Okay, so what do we have on here? Knit Crate, mem knit crate membership like a, a Knit Crate sub. Okay, Knit Crate a membership is again an in house brand. Okay, we have over here Audine Woods and we have a olive color and we have 50% alpaca, 30% merino wool and 20% nylon. It's a DK weight and we have 236 yards, 250 meters. Oh my, I love it so much. Ooh, so beautiful. Okay, let's go through. I'm not touching the other one. Let's keep it nice and neat. Okay, so with the knit crate, Audin wools. So here it is. There are actually four colors. So I got olive, but there are other, other colors. Oh, you can see it, how beautiful they are. And uh, now we have, this one is crochet, isn't it? Yeah, I see crochet, moss boss. And this is a moss boss. It's nice, isn't it? It's really nice. We have Huerta. You have also here um, the artisan crate patterns, which we have this first frost. That's also calls for DK or, or a hat. That also is in DK. Um, so that's really nice because they give you, actually they thought it through, they're giving you an option. Even if you got a Knit Crate membership box, you can knit artisans as uh, patterns too. And when you get self crate or artisan crate, you could actually, you actually ended up having two patterns. So I think it's a brilliant idea. I can't wait to see how they're going to split it. Presume that the socks will go together and the uh, uh, the bigger crates goes together so to get it lighter and I enjoyed it so much do you see it if you have any ideas what else I could knit with it uh, let me know it's so nice it's so nice I think I'm going with like artisan I'm going to knit that hat because I'm a hat addict and it's a beautiful hat so I can't wait to do that with this one actually I'm uh, going with more of a usage of my own or usage on my own, which is um, I want to make a ninja bike mask. <laughs> but I need something to keep my mouth warm when I'm using my scooter. We have alpaca, we have merino, we have nylon, so it'd be sturdy. Um, I love it so much. Okay, I'm so excited. I hope you got your ones. Let me know which one of those three that I got you like the most. I haven't showed you one more, which is Artisan Sock Crate. But as you could have had a sneak peek. Even though I did not get it, I got the pattern and I wonder if you're going to get that too. You can have a sneak peek what the actual yarn looks like. Sometimes with artisans they have only one skein, one color, um, but sometimes they have different colors that, that you don't know where you, which one you're going to get. Anything else? If you got your ones and you're already knitting with it, please use hashtag knitting I love, show me what you're knitting or tag me. Also, don't forget to follow Knit Crate. I'm going to put all the links down below. You can also join their every group. I love it so much. Thank you so much for sending these boxes my way. I hope you enjoy watching it. Now you have an idea what Knit Crate offers in the month of October. In November they have something new and a new box coming in. They're going to, I'm just showing you this, they're going to collaborate with Malabrigo and I'm not sure, it's not a monthly box, I think it comes every second or third month. Um, I think the price was $45, that's what I've heard about. There, I think there's going to be a goodie or actually two goodies in it but 
but but if you want some spoilers go to knit crate they have also a spoiler i think tab or menu thing that you can have a peek what's the next one is going to bring um i hope you enjoyed this one see you next one don't forget to subscribe till the next one bye